As we get closer to Ultraman Jeet's movie release date, we finally get to see his ultimate final form and that is called the Jeet's Ultimate Final. His final weapon, the Giga Finalizer, is also already announced ahead of the movie with a special capsule that enables Riku to hench into his ultimate final form. Now we can't wait for the movie as we do want to see Guy Kuronai to return back in action as Ultraman Orb and also our favourite antagonist Juggler's Juggler will be back as well. Um, as for the ultimate final form for Ultraman G, we have to say that it does look a lot better and with the colour combination of blue, red and gold, it also does remind us of the Ultraman Mabius um, suit as well. And just in time for the movie, Bandai also released the Jeet's Royal Mega Master form. This is an excellent figure and for those of you who are collecting the Jeet Universe lineup, I think this is a must have because you don't really get to see uh, Ultraman Fathers and also the Ultraman Belial combination too much in the market. So this is a must have if you are collecting not only the SHF line but also the Ultraman Jeet series. Perhaps the most interesting release for 2018 is going to be this, the Ultraman Orb of Vanica. This is of course a uh, replica of the harmonica that was used by Kai Gurunai in the Ultraman Orb series. Now bear in mind this is not an actual prop replication from the show itself, but this is a toy. Yeah. So this toy actually contains 30 of the line that Kai Gurunai uses in the show and of course the mainstay, the trademark melody that he used in the show as well. So for us being a huge Ultraman Orb fans, we'll probably try and get this. But this being a premium bundle exclusive, this is going to be expensive. This costs about 5940 yen. Bandai continues to release more figures from the Kamen Rider build series. The new one, which is called the Rabbit Tank Sparkling Form, is unfortunately a premium bundle exclusive yet again. So this time around, I will say that you know, while I'm not being a big fan of the Kamen Rider build look, overall look, but this figure itself, the Rabbit Tank Sparkling Form, does look quite interesting, you know. Um, but unfortunately, again, it's a premium bundle, so we're probably going to skip that. But what's more interesting would be the next figure that's coming from uh, Bandai SHF series. And that will be the Command Rider Close Charge. So this kit, finally, I think I really like the overall look of it. Uh, it looks like everything is in chrome silver. And this... Fortunately, it's not a Premium Bandai exclusive, so you'll be able to get this in the retail stores by late June or early July. So that's pretty much our coverage for Ultraman and Kamen Rider this week. And to be very frank, I would like to know how many of you are actually looking forward to Ultraman Jeet's movie. Not because of Ultraman, but also maybe because of Laiha Toba. So any fans of Laiha Toba, please raise your hand and put your comments down below. Thank you for watching and do share this video if you loved it.